Well, hey there, guys. So, um, just gonna chat for the next five minutes or so. Uh, <clears throat> About my week. So uh, yeah, Fallout 4 is coming out uh, tomorrow. Um, shush! Bastards. So yeah, Fallout 4 is coming out tomorrow. Um, very excited about that. I'm not going to get mine until probably like the 13th, which is a Friday, which is not a, a good date really. But um, yeah, uh, I'm very excited about that. Um, I'm hoping nobody bothers to post on social media any um, like spoilers about it because uh, that would piss me off immensely. So I'm, I'm cutting out social media and uh, news feeds and things for a few days because I don't want people spoiling it. One thing I'm going to show you. This. Here we go. So uh, people in the West will not have seen these before. Uh, this is basically... Uh, Ika, which is squid. This, I can't remember this one, uh, but this means shape, shape. And then uh, tempura. So uh, basically it's a squid shaped fried stuff. Um, to be honest, it smells like private parts that, you know, after you've been for a run or something. It doesn't smell too good, but, oh, broken one, there we go. There you go, that's what it looks like. And this is basically a piece of fried squid with uh, tempura coating on it. So, um, squid, for those of you who don't know, is an octopus with ten legs. Um, and based on the uh, kraken, but this is obviously a smaller version, so... Uh... Mm -hmm. Very nice, very nice. And what better to wash it down with than Suntory Premium Molds? No. So, um, I'm collecting stickers at the moment, these stickers. Um, rude to eat and talk, isn't it? Uh, basically, if you collect the stickers and you get enough of them, you can get one of these things. So, you can get this one, which is a drink and a glass. This one, another drink in a glass, what are these? Um, oh, this one's just premium malts, the normal. Yeah, this one is the uh, Pilsner version. You need 48 points to get this and this, or 84 to get this one. You know, I want this one. So at the moment, I've got quite a few. So uh, the blue ones and green ones are worth 1.5 points. Brown ones are one point and the purple one is two points. They different kinds of beers from Suntory and they yield different points. But anyway, let's have a drink, wash down my, my squid snack. <sighs> very nice, very nice. This is probably one of my favorite premium beers in Japan. This one, Yebis and Asahi Premium, the gold can. Anyway, uh, another thing I'm gonna eat, this. Uh, this is uh, umeboshi. Uh, umeboshi, for those of you who don't know, is uh, Japanese plum. And uh, Japanese plums are quite sour and bitter. I don't like sour, bitter things. But uh, I had super lemon candy, um, and people seem to like my reaction. Oh, fucking hell. Because uh, it's really sour. So what, is it, what do these things look like? They look like... To be honest, it looks like a foreskin after like a bris from you know Jewish ceremony. Look, you've even got the you've even got the urethra hole in there. But these are going to be bitter as hell. But yeah, it's basically plum, pickled, dried, uh, flattened out, and uh, it's, uh, uh. ooh, mm, sharp. Oh, it's this is Hachimitsu, which is honey. It's supposed to have honey on it to sweeten it up, but oh, it's still pretty sharp. How many are in here? One, two, oh, let's have a look. So, yeah, look, we got everything, all of them. Every single one. They're pretty bitter. So, uh, let's go for. <laughs> uh uh. Oh, 
Oh my god. dried it's delicious it really is buy them buy them what am I doing with my life so um, yeah as I mentioned Fallout's coming out pretty excited about that um, the only other thing that I, that's happened to me this this week really is uh, I, I get my like shirts because I sometimes have to wear like suit shirts and pants and stuff for work but uh, I, I go to a dry cleaners to get them cleaned and pressed and everything and I usually go every two weeks, and by then I've got like 20 items to give the lady. And um, there's one old lady there that she kind of grates on my nerves a bit. She can't count past eight. She she stands there and she, she picks them all up off the rail and she lays them down and then she looks at the receipts. And last time I went there, it clearly said 19, which is, you know, Juku, juku Mai. My means like how many quantifiers sort of thing, but uh, she said, "Oh, do you, you know." But she just read the nine. She's like, "Oh, Q mine." I, I said, "You know, oh, yeah, it's kind of do Q mine. That's not right. It's this number." But anyway, she um, she realised her mistake and then started counting them. She got to eight and then she moved them aside. And then she got the next lot and started counting again, starting from one. So she was like, you know, ich ni san shi go rok shi hachi hachi mai dong ich ni san shi go rok shi hachi kyu ju. Zubasen, chotto matte ne. And then she started again. And then she counted eight again and moved them with the other eight. And then she counted three more. Which, you know, 8 plus 8 plus 3 is 19. Uh, she couldn't figure that out, so, you know, she then said, Oh, there's there's 21? <laughs> no, there's 8, 8, and 3. But she was like, Oh, she was saying, Chotomatene. And then she started counting the whole fucking lot again. I only had like five minutes to collect this stuff, get back, quickly throw on one of the shirts, one of the sets of trousers, and leg it out the door to get to work on time. Suffice to say, I was in there for 15 minutes while she was screwing around getting this bloody counting done. I, end, I ended up counting it for her in the end. It got kind of annoying after a while, but um, whenever I go in there and I see her, my immediate thought is, shit, not this lady again. But uh, yeah, that's about it for my week. Not much really happened, to be honest. Um, just been relaxing a little bit, because uh, I've got like, uh, what, five or six more weeks of work then I've got a bit of a holiday but I got a lot to do in that holiday time then I start with my new job which will be nice um, I'm a bit excited about it because it means that my working hours are reduced by uh, quite a lot and I start earlier finish earlier no weekends so I can actually have some time for you know family, friends, gaming, video editing, to do, to do some of the stuff, because I'm so behind on video editing, it is ridiculous, because I don't have time, because of my workload, and because of my work and times. It's so erratic, it's crazy, but uh, hopefully by January, once I start my new schedule, um, things will go back to being normal, and uh, I can edit my videos on, a, on the weekend, get them up and online by Monday, and have a regular upload pattern, which is going to be good. So uh, yeah, that's enough for me today. That I rambled and whittled on enough, but just you know, brief review of what's been happening lately. So uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and uh, yeah, see you next video. Thanks to everyone for watching and supporting my channel. As always, please leave a like and comment, as your feedback is greatly appreciated. And if you haven't already, subscribe now. Also, you may like to follow me on Twitter, like my Facebook page, add me as a friend, add me to your Google circles, follow me on Instagram, add me on Tumblr, join my group, subscribe to my Twitch account, reshare my Facebook posts, retweet all my tweets, like all my statuses and pictures coming from everything I've done and watch every single video I've made, twice. Thank you.